Alright YouTube, what is up? I'm back again with another MET25 video. I'm just following this ghost promo out and just going to show you guys some of the cards. So I figured I'd get to that. If you guys haven't seen the cards already, I'm going to show them to you. Mostly the Ghost of Madden's Past and I'm going to show you quickly some of these holiday out of position cards. Here's George Blonda with, I don't think this card's good at all. I'm not sure why he's going for 24k. That's ridiculous. Um, he, he's got a, oh, he's got a 95 kick power, and you can get, a, you can straight up get a better kicker out of Sebastian Janikowski for a lot cheaper. So, there's fullback William Perry, uh, probably a coveted card. He's one of the most, he is the most expensive out of position player, um, except for Walter Payton. He's tied with Walter Payton, but I'll show you him in a minute. Here are the Ghosts of Madden's Pass, and here's, these are out for the first four days in packs, and if you do the collection, you can get one of the four. So here's Thurman Thomas. A few stat upgrades there. I'm a little disappointed he still only has a 94 carry. Um, I really like guys with high carries. It's important to me. I don't like fumbling at all. His truck's only a 93 also, but it's a Thurman Thomas. He's a really fast back, and he can truck really well too, so... I can compare him a lot to Walter Payton with the 93 truck and the 96 speed. They're, those are the same, but um, I don't know. There's different stats for different people, so let's see who else. Steve Young, I think this is one of the better ghosts this year, and all of these ghosts of Madden's Pass guys are going to be the highest of the, all of the ghosts because the futures are going to be mid-90s and the... Uh, uh, the futures, excuse me. The presents are going to be mid 90s and the futures are going to be low 90s. So these are the 99 overalls. So I think these are all going to be good cards. But this Steve Young is very good with a 91 throw deep accuracy and a 90 speed. Very mobile and very accurate quarterback. But most people don't like lefties. Um, I think he's a really nice card, but that's my personal opinion. And here's Reggie White going for 200k right now. These cards obviously all go for quite a bit. And I do really want this card with 83 speed and that much power, strength, and block shed. That is a ridiculously good card in my opinion. And I know the 97 one has, he's pretty close to that, but he's got a little lower speed. So I think this card is a very good card and I look forward to hopefully getting this card sometime soon. Let's see, the other two are, and oh, excuse me, other two. The other one is Derek Thomas. Um, there's the stats real quick. I'm going to talk about it while I go to the next section. But Derek Thomas, I've been waiting for him for a while now, and I was excited for him. And I'm a little disappointed because he's not my chem, <laughs> but that's all right. He's still a beastly card. If when you saw those stats, all around, he is a monster at everything so I mean I don't there is he's just he's a very good player to have I think and if you can afford him he's really expensive but if you can afford him you probably won't need to replace him up until the end of the year so he's a very good card and I think one of the best left outside linebackers to play with a 90 speed I think that ties Von Miller for the fastest left outside linebacker. So let's get into some of these lower level cards, these out of position cards, the holiday editions. We have Josh Cribbs. We have, let's talk about the quarterbacks first. We have Josh Cribbs, Denard Robinson, and I'll show you. Um, I will show you Mr. Uh, goodness, I can't, uh, Walter Payton. Walter Payton's a really good card. I don't. I'm not a huge fan of these other two. Josh Cribbs at all. I'm not a fan of at all. I, he thought he made a great pass when he did that. When he did pass the ball um, to his receiver, I thought he made a great pass, but he didn't get a very good card. Denard Robinson's pretty fast. Has decent accuracy, I guess. So it might be somewhat usable. Not too sure. I probably won't use him at all. But and now let's get into free safeties. These two cards, I'm actually really interested in these free safety cards. I do want to try them out, both of them, so I'll probably get into that. 
Dez is going to be a little more only because he's uh, got 91 speed as opposed to Jimmy Graham who's got an 85. But Jimmy Graham is 6'7", guys, so he can go up for those balls and probably will come down with them when it comes to a jump ball. However, Dez might be better otherwise. So um, I have heard this Jimmy Graham can hit really well because Jimmy Graham is six foot seven and he's huge. So I mean I, I that's a theory I've heard. Also this tight end I pulled John Donald Penn. Uh, I've, I'll give a slight review for him. I haven't thrown to him yet, but he does block very well at goal line guys. He just he pancaked two people, so that's pretty impressive. One card I will probably buy in front of your eyes right now is not this Mike James. I'm not sure why. It's just a running back, so I don't know what significance. He probably has some quarterback stats in there, but I probably won't use him. It's not my forte. He's not. He doesn't even look like a good card, but... That's all right. One card I probably will get in front of your eyes is this punter, Ben Roethlisberger. So at fourth and two, I will be going for it because, I mean, it gets snapped back to your punter and you expect your punter to make a throw. He's got not very good kick power, but good kick accuracy, I guess. So decent punter, but he is also a good passer. So when I do fakes, he'll be pretty darn accurate, which is nice. And luxurious. I think those are the only two in this tier. And last but not least, there are two more guys. Deion Sanders and Walter Payton. Walter Payton, I mentioned. Oh, and Maurice Jones-Drew. But once again, a lot like that Mike James. Not really special. Just another running back. Probably with a quarterback stat in there. Here's Walter Payton. Guys, he's... I think this card is pretty decent with an 85 throw accuracy. That's pretty impressive. And a 96 speed. That is unbelievable. So a very good card here. But he's tied for the most expensive player. Uh, out of position player that's not a Ghost of Madden's past anyway. And the other one is Deion Sanders. Wide receiver Deion's been around Mutt for a while now he was in Mutt 12, and he was a very good slot receiver. And, you know, being 6 foot and 97 speed, he's a burner and a great slot receiver. At the same time, first of all, I like my slot receivers to be able to do some route running. And when you have – there aren't many burners better than this Deion Sanders card, guys, but that one is. <laughs> 98 speed, so – I don't need this Dion. However, I do suggest this card. Put him in slot. Put him on streaks. He will burn. And he'll probably come up with a catch with a 92 catching, which is pretty nice. So, let's see. That's really it, guys. I do want to give away my pull today. I did pull Denard Robinson, the quarterback. And, you know, if you're a Jags fan or you just have an interest to try out this Denard Robinson, just enter to win. The word for this one is day two promo. Again, day two promo. He's ground and pound, a decent a decent card. I think he's one of the he's better than Josh Cribbs, that's what matters. So I am giving this card away, and you just need to be liked and you need a like and be subscribed. So that's really it, guys. Keep up with me with the holiday editions and Merry Christmas to you all. Um, I hope you all have a great rest of your year. So. Till next time, guys. Peace out.